From the beginning, she claimed the accusations were false. And now, prosecutors agree they have dropped criminal abuse charges against a Lexington daycare owner. She had been accused of injuring a child in her care. But as WKYT's Mark Barber tells us, new at 6, the woman says the accusations hurt her business. Savola Marks is standing tall after her attorney says false accusations have beaten her down for months. It's been 100 days or more of pure suffering where she's been vilified. Marks, the owner of Children's Treehouse of Knowledge, was charged with third degree criminal abuse in June after she was accused of hurting a child at her daycare. This was a disgruntled employee who decided that she was going to try to take away the livelihood and the reputation of Ms. Marks. According to an arrest warrant, the child said that while Marks was disciplining him, she gave him a friction burn on his arm, bent his fingers back to cause pain, and bent his arms back to restrict his breathing. Mark's attorney says the false accusations didn't stand up in court. Today, the prosecution dropped the case, but the serious allegations have already done serious damage. Business-wise, there have been people who haven't enrolled. There are people who couldn't come back. There are ch children that moved on that she's not been able to continue to assist. It's decreased her enrollment. While it's been hard, she will make it. Her attorney says her character has protected her. If it had not been for her reputation and the people that she had helped along the way, I think that it probably would have crumbled. Now she's free to go back to her business, and she's free to care for children like she has been for 30 years. In Lexington, Mark Barber, WKYT. We're told the employee who accused Marks quit her job at the daycare the day she made the allegations.